I think I'm tired. I'm tired of sometimes pretending. Let me just be honest. I'm tired of pretending. Call me what you want to call me. Call me negative. Call me whatever you want to call me. It's totally fine. But I'm tired of pretending. And asking that everything is okay when everything is not okay. People sleeping with, with school girls, primary school, secondary school girls, teenagers. Some impregnating them, some not. Some the things that are on, on camera, lying to you guys to be on camera, smiling to you, telling you maybe someone has misbehaved, misbehaved with a, a 12 year or 13 year old kid. Then I come and smile to you and say, guys, everything is okay. The old community is branded as either pigs or scammers or what because of one or two or three or four people. I want you guys to know my personality. I don't want you to know me for having just defended Marwa or Marwa's family and all that. I don't want you to know me like that anymore. That should just add to my CV. Hey, hey. Finally, 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 uh, Minhawi has spoken, guys. Uh, but it's a very chilly morning over here. I have to do this video. Based on how I'm doing this video, I'm not a reaction. But we are trying to anal analyze uh, what's going wrong, anything going good, and other things anyway, guys. But anyway, welcome back to this our new channel, and most welcome again and again. Thank you very much for watching, if you're watching right now. Let's check and find out uh, what <coughs> Minhawi said. And my question is, Minhawi, what came into your mind? Because... I've noticed a lot of things you are talking or you are speaking out here are very sensitive things. I'm still asking myself, why you post to do this kind of video? Or you just settled down and decided, let me do this video? Because, you know, for someone to come out under that pressure, you know, the way you are, you are, you are expressing yourself, so me there is something really in you. You are very, very hunger like I can't explain, but the reality is, I'm asking myself, uh, you know, I've seen these videos really trending around, and I'm wondering what's happening. So when I check on this, Perry, um, then how it, what you have said, fine, it might be true, but I'm still having some questions in these videos. Guys, watch this video and see. Uh, listen to what Min Howie was saying about uh, his own stand, the decision, the current decision, and the current situation, and everything. And let's understand this. Fine, it's, you have a freedom of speech, but let's check out on this and see what was this girl saying, and how will it end? Check on this. To a lazy gang or a belong to a positive gang or a gang. I just want to do things for me. It's, I feel like it's high time I left that uh, uh, that that level of belonging, I don't know if that makes sense, belonging and uh, just being like, um, like I have, to, I have to do something or I have to defend or I have to protect. I think even Mara told me sometimes that's let go of reaction and all that kind of thing, but I think he was right. But this time I want to just be able to air my opinion. I don't want to do things because someone has told me anymore before. I want to do things because that is the right thing to do. Is that makes sense? Now, according to what you've seen, it's fine for someone to take its own decision because we must have a, a freedom of life, freedom of movement, freedom of speech, and everything. Or which I would, I would, I cannot stop someone from having freedom of speech. But I am in how Did you learn these things before, or just notice right now? Fine, we don't want to categorize you in any direction, either reactors or non-reactors. But the thing is, it's fine to come out and be clear. But what time is it? I think when you notice something's going so wrong on the other side, uh, sometimes we need to settle and think about it and then we explore it before it gets to us. Uh, because since we get to Ayamarwa uh, party up to now, it's around, uh, mm, it's around nine months, definitely. And right now you are coming out clear and saying these things that I can't hear here that uh, teenagers who are being slept with, impregnated, and such on. But what did you do at the first place when you noticed these things? You know, you are a great friend of mine, and I understand you, I love you like my sister. But now coming out with this, so 
what was happening because according to me i was in that party but i didn't get anything like this like i was, I was done man someone can make me understand this but the reality is uh, coming out right now to explore and to explain such sensitive issues what did you do my question is that did you express it did you tap and because fine reactors were doing their own part but now i can see it's like you're now getting back to answer their question or to say yes to these things they were saying but how can we approve this uh the truth about it how does it comes up that's my question and that's why i'm wondering right now you come you have came out clear lazing no 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 i'm no longer there like i'm i'm going to be on my own but these things we need to take them clear and how do we do it because when you know whenever we talk we might say something that gonna end us in a very different way but right here uh, guys i want you to listen and understand what we how it say here guys you know it's a very sensitive case it's a very sensitive issue that can end someone into a very dangerous zone you know that's a defilement case because when you say a teenager how it is how did it come out and are we able to prove one or two listen to me now speech here and guys let's understand some something noted now according to that uh, to the speech what's your take and i want to just know this on the comment and my big question still goes there that what did you do and are you able to bring one or two out it's fine to stand on your own or is are you been influenced by someone to come out and do this or is it the aim of content fine i've, I've understand my friend that you have, have been truly on pressure fine it's good for someone to be on his own and it's good to work you know and a present that's why we decided to do our own things our own business over here so my question still goes to you dear i want us to always to be clear in whatever we are doing because uh for nine months if maybe someone was impregnated right now i think they have new bodies is it there yeah we need to check on this too because before we say something before we do anything guys we need to check on that. I'm doing this video early in the morning, guys, when I'm just up. And uh, it's so prudent to make things clear before they explore. So uh, let's analyze this and let's understand this. Fine. That's done. I want you uh, to listen to another point that's here that he really hit me so much. Hit me like, I just feel like, what happened? What? So I want you to listen to this. Uh, I mean, how is speech uh, for the day or whatever you did right here? He was trying to speak about our audience being scam, uh, being uh, scammed and other things like yeah, money and other things. But you are saying things weren't clear. You need to come out and speak. People should not do that to them. Then we listen. And what, how it is? Let me understand. I want my audience kindly listen to this video before we continue and see what we need. Let me see right here.
Now, that's a big question. That, fine now you turn out to start on your own. But, what about the rest of the month that I've gone? And my big question is to you, why now? Yeah, that's, I think that should be our big question. Why now? You know, guys, there's something I came to learn. Uh, pressure, number one, can make you do things that you are not ready to do. The pressure in you or the pressure environment situation and the community pressure and other things. But no one has authority to remove or get out words from your mouth, maybe, or even what you are thinking. Because whatever I'm thinking right here where I am, it's me and me alone. No one can know. And even my child cannot tell that, you know, daddy's thinking about this. So uh, I always wish to understand things, guys, because uh, we are always being advised to prevent one is better than cure. Why don't we prevent them before they, uh, they, they, they emerge or before they, they, they damage something? And why coming out today? You know, for example, I can come out today and start saying this and this is bad. But by that time, I was cool and quiet. You know, you are someone that you can be judged because even the Bible said that if you notice someone is doing something wrong but you didn't let them know, then they die, that sin be on you. And if you notice that they, they, are doing, they are doing something wrong and then you correct them, whether they have stopped it or they continued, you are now safe. So my big question is, did you do anything? It's fine. The reactors have been making noise both sides of the corner. And let me tell you now, the truth is fine. You are saying that you want to be on your own. But do you know they must categorize you in another place? Fine. Uh, I know uh, we are not, not that you are fighting Marwa, not that you are a reactor. You have very clear. And I love your thought. I love your stand, how you are. It's good to be on your own and do your own things. You know yourself. But let me tell you this, Minhawi, mm, one day, one time, you are going to be categorized in another side. So you better understand that. And you need to be so careful about this. Maybe you are doing these things under pressure or a lot of hunger and everything about what's happening in the village. Fine. But you need to find something uh, somewhere. Just chill and rest your mind because on a pressure, you might end up in a, a very dangerous state. That's the reality, you know. Because whatever you say, someone might come to you. Now, I want you to go and explain for me what you are saying about the young kids. Those are the teenagers or the pupils. And you know in Kenya, guys, if you are found with such cases of dealing with the teenagers, that's something we call it a um, defilement case. And you'll be jailed forever. Guys, anyway, I'm talking here, but I'm having a very strong feeling today. I don't think, I just think because of the uh, journey and everything that I was going through. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. I don't want to go further in this uh, clarification, but we are just trying to create awareness and also to let other people who are also willing to come into the platform with such kind of cases to understand some things there before we react. So that's how it is. And right here, I am very grateful. Thank you very much, guys, for the great support. Much love from Moses. And, and yes, Analysis, new channel with you guys. Kindly support, subscribe, road to 1000 over here. We love you so much and amazing. The best is yet to come. We're going to follow everything that's happening. But let's see how it goes. As you are finishing your video, you said, thank you, Marwa. And yet, you are now trying, you are, you are trying to bring things into so that things weren't okay. And... Why must you quote by thanking Mama? Never reactors. I think uh, once you start on your own, my dear, now you should not deal with any party. Like if you are in both parties, you are independent now, you don't go any side, you stand on your own. Fine. I know you love and you respect Ayamaro, and we do the same. And I'm here still to say thank you, Mama, for giving us this platform. Because everything that happens today are happening because of Ayamaro. He's the one who came up with this thing, idea in the village. And then people came in. He recruited a lot of people because they were in need. And right now, they turned against him. Uh, as, as you watch this video, guys, I think there's something we need to keep on learning. that What will happen after you help someone? And how will we need a true, will we know a true friend? How will we know a true follower? So these things comes together. In my mind, when I was watching these videos, I was saying, what's happening? Um, 
And without this, we can say it's a platform, it's a YouTube game, people are trying to fight for their benefits. It's fine. But also sometimes we need to brand our brand. You understand? You brand your brand. Be you the way uh, uh, the how it wanted to be his own and to do her own things. It's fine. But now just know you are in a very tricky situation with my sister in that people will be trying to weigh which side are you and what are you going to do. They are trying to check. The reactors will bring the videos on board and see will you talk about them if you start on your own or how will you do it. I think if you want to start on our own at all time, we need to stop being in any side of reaction or not doing anything. Just do your own videos and go. Ignore anything that goes in the village. If you ignore anything that comes across to you about YouTubers and other things, then you'll be you. But anyway, guys, I, I'm so happy to meet you this moment. Very happy. Keep on watching this video, guys, to the end. I'm lovely. Most welcome. Again and again, the best year to come. We want to hear and anal analyze and everything. Anyway, thank you very much, Minawi. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mara. Thank you, Reactor. Thank you, everyone. Watch my videos starting here. Moses from NBS. It's Kenya to the world.